Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to change how many days you have in order to roll back a Windows upgrade feature in Windows 10. So I believe it used to be like 15 days or so that you had to roll back feature upgrades in Windows that they basically roll out to all users. However, I believe now it is up to 30 days at the time of this recording. But if you want to get even more days out of your decision making process, this tutorial will be for you. So very straightforward process today and we are going to go ahead and start by left clicking on the start button one time. Type in PowerShell. When the best manager should say Windows PowerShell, you want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to left click on yes. Now I'm going to have a command in the description of the video, a DISM command. Copy it out of my description. And you want to go ahead and modify the value. So currently I have it set at 30 days is what the value I'm going to have in the description of my video. I have to put a value in there. However, you can change that 30 to as many days as you want. So you can change it to 365 if you want to have a year or 1000 if you want a few years. I mean, it's pretty much up to you at that point. I'm going to just change it to 90 for simplicity's sake. So again, in the description I have 30 days. You can change it to 90 or whatever. Again, that's just the number that comes right after value. And once you've made that change, you want to copy it and then go up to the top of this Windows PowerShell window. Right click on it, left click on edit, and then left click on paste. Once you paste it in, hit enter. Give it a moment here. And that should be about it. So once you're done, just close out of here, restart your computer, and hopefully you have extended your days that you have to roll back feature upgrades. So as always, thank you guys for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.